Uncle says you're reliable. I just need to pick up some more ammo. Vito said you'd be expecting me. Took you long enough. I'm Jock Blanchard. Vito claims you can unfug this mess and get us working men back on a job. Maybe. Depends if your information's any good. Used to kick up to Vito's men Andy Toretto for union work. But now that Coyon Greco got Andy squeezing everybody for more dues. You don't pay, you don't get a work permit. Poor fucks even gotta use Greco's loudmouth buddies to collect. This Greco sounds like a real piece of shit. <laughs> you don't know the half of it. On top of that, Andy's gotta keep the permits under lock and key. Anything happens to those, oof. Ain't no work happening around here. I'll see what I can get out of Toretto's people. It's a tight ship, but you should be able to get some of his guys talking. They really ought to just knock this place down. Why'd that man got a gun? You just think you're here. I think Ooh. we got ourselves an admirer. See anything? That was fucking brutal.
Hold up, mister. I didn't see anything. I need to learn that shit. Oh! Why'd you kill him? Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. Better get out of here, boy. That was... Huh? Something ain't right about this. Nothing over here, fellas. Oh. Oh, oh, holy shit. shit! He killed that boy. Oh, oh shit! <laughs> I say you owe dues. You better fucking pay. Huh? The fuck? Next time, keep your damn mouth shut. Get out of here! You motherfuckers need to wait this your turn. This is what happens when your lip off. You want a permit? You need to wait. Oh, Ooh. holy shit! Run! Run! You want a work permit? You need to come through me. Oh, you don't want to put the Oh God! In. Holy Good. shit! Kick Where his you ass! From? Fill out those forms. I'm getting for me tired of asking about it. Clear out! Hurry! This is what happens Holy when you're he's on the drug in. Draw, motherfucker. for me.
to black off him. Jesus Christ! Must be getting old or something. Yeah. <laughs> 
You're a big one, ain't you? Where'd you go, you fuck? Get someone out here to River Row for this cash. Sure thing, Cher. Heading your way now. The Union here ain't what it should. As good a job as you've done slowing work at the Dock Union. I'm surprised Tavero's not out in the street and hunting you himself. Word is, Andy Toretto's down at the dock union, demanding to know who's been stopping his people from collecting dues. Think he tipped off Greco to what's been happening? Nah. Knowing Andy, he'd probably see Greco in the ground next to you if he could. But he's a lifer, and if he's got a job to do, He's gonna goddamn well do it. Bad fucking situation all around. And it's about to get worse. 
Tell the boys they'll be back to work soon, Jock. It's not easy to shake folks out of their complacency. To teach them that pulling a lever in a voting booth can actually bring about earth shattering change. Wearing a fucking work permits? What's the point of that? Can't we just print up some more? Jesus Christ. Look, that's not how it works. Those little slips of paper tell us who owes what. All that shit. Besides that, it's making us look weak. The who? The working man. Lord help! Mind your place, boy. You're supposed to have my back. Mr. Toretto sees you stoned again, and he's gonna deal with you. That wasn't squat. Didn't find school. Rest in peace. No trace of him here. with that pretty little Creole girl. Lula? Lola. You want him brought back general or not so general? <laughs> Only mistake Bird made was fucking around after proposing to my little girl. Keep her ready for the wedding. I'll take a couple of guys. No, you handle it. I need to keep enough muscle around in case that fucking nigga decides to show his face around here. 
Like I need Greco up my ass about one more thing. Something's wrong. Holy shit! It's no time, boys! Either you kill me, or that piss ain't Greco does. Well, since Greco ain't here. The Doc Union's under control. Put some of you guys on it. Today, I'm sure the file on Vito Skelet is about three feet thick, but that wasn't always the case. Hoover didn't even acknowledge the Mafia existed until 1957, so we weren't really keeping tabs on guys like Vittorio Scaletta till after that. Now, we know he served in World War II and did a six-year stint in prison for theft and illegal distribution of federal rations. It's, uh, it's generally believed he was a made member of the Falcone family in Empire Bay, though he's also a suspect in the death of Don Carlo Falcone. Now, if he did kill the Don, Vito must have had friends in high places because he was allowed to live. He was exiled, though, and forced to relocate down here, and the commission convinced Sal Marcano to make Vito a lieutenant and give him some rackets. 